Hello, and welcome to the stream. Welcome back. We're going to try to do a little bit of streaming tonight for uh, Project uh, Lazarus. Uh, I'm having fun with the game. I uh, wanted to make some progress on it. Didn't want to get too far ahead of the kind of the video I've been running in the background. Um, so I wanted to kind of do that. Uh, let me, I want to try this real quick. While we're at it, we're not really started yet. It's still not working. I don't know why. Why my Lumia stream is not working. Uh, is it? It's all connected. One second. Give me a second, guys. I'm gonna look at my Lumia stream while we're getting set up here. Because unfortunately, it does not work until I'm actually live. So it says everything is connected. Yeah, it says that I did Jaws. So it did it again. Uh, let's try that. Okay, so that worked. So the commands aren't working. That's it. Uh, what are trying to command here? Um, oh, maybe that's what's going on. No, because that's it. That is a command. So that's that one works. I'm very confused. I don't understand what's happening with, with, with that. All right, let's get on with it. So it is working. It is connected. Um, so for those that don't know, I, ha I, I have Lumia Stream. Lumia Stream is awesome. So all the lights you see in my room, uh, we type in commands. Uh, we can activate them. Uh, my, my ultimate goal is to try to bring some of the, the stuff to Twitch over uh, so that we have some interaction. We can have some stuff like that. And hopefully, hopefully get that uh, kind of going. All right, so we're gonna do a new game. Uh, supposedly, they they uh, there was a change to Benedict. I'm probably gonna be doing a lot of Benedict because uh, he's he's kind of my favorite one. Uh, I did open hyper mode on the grasslands and the desert. Uh, I think I'm gonna keep I'm gonna work on the Arctic glacier to see if we can get get that open there. Good to know. So, yeah, so the chat is slow coming into Streamlabs. 15, 40, 30, 20. So I am having a lot of fun with this game. Uh, kind of the puzzly, you know, building, building side of it. Uh, auto turret. Uh... Oh, I got like five re rolls. Let's just re roll. Let's let's get something better. Uh, Tesla coil. Uh, I I can start with some Tesla coils. I can I can I can get behind that. I can get behind some Tesla coils for the win. Let's see. Uh, not 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 get Cerebus. I am not I'm not a fan of, of Cerebus. I don't well it I don't know I, what would happen if we got three of them. I know with two, it, uh, it does like, you know, like an asterisk almost. Uh, super damage or chem tank. I think we'll go with chem tank. Super damage would have been nice. And in the long run, eh, it may, may have been a better choice. Uh, but getting two pim tanks this early, that is, that is just, that is just good, good business right there. So, if you guys do not know what this game is, uh, if you haven't, uh, looked at it, uh, please go check it out. Um, as far as I can tell, it's made by a single, a single developer. Uh, so there's a single person building the game. Uh, so it's not the fastest updating and stuff like that. It, it does take up some time to kind of get things updated. 
Uh, but it is a good game, and, and the fact that it's a single person making it makes it even better, I think. Uh, <laughs> Obviously, it's never going to be like, you know, full open world, you know, super game or anything. But I'm okay with that. I am okay. Oh, now we'll take increased damage now. How about that? See? Well, it works out. Uh, so, uh, I, I wanted to kind of do some leveling, uh, try to get some of the things open. Uh, uh, rate of fire. I like I like rate of fire. I I can get behind some rate of fire. More more pews, more DACA. Yeah, put enough uh enough bullets on target. That uh that usually works out for me. I do find out I I do uh do find that if you pump enough bullets into things, they have a tendency to stop trying to kill you. Sometimes you just got to put enough bullets into them, though. So the good news is, is we are actually trying to shoot at the guys on the, the edge of the, the map now. I don't think we're going to get through that not with his weapon, but we are at least putting holes in them. <laughs> Had enough of that. I'm gonna run away now. Thanks. I don't know. I, I haven't tried Orbital Striker uh, really well. But Orbital Striker, from what I've seen, kind of uh, kind of all over the place uh, when it fires. Oh, and uh, they did implement a uh, the ability to turn down the uh, the volume of the and change the sound effect for the uh, picking up stuff so that's good because for a while the uh picking up the gems or the crystals uh was was quite annoying so that is that has been changed uh i think the cosmic guardian is not a bad well i didn't need to install that but now i now i have it Wasn't gonna. I was gonna re-roll it, and I, I clicked the wrong button because I did dumb. Because the guardian is not a bad thing to have. To to be fair, like it's I don't want another machine gun. Yeah, too much too daka, and uh. Lots of lots of anger. That's that's what we have now. Yeah, I was gonna go for another uh, Tesla turret up there, but I failed. Now I only have one. Guess it will have to do. That being said, of course. Uh, Getting, you know, the Cosmic Guardian. Yeah, it's it's an okay uh, consolation prize. Cosmic Guardian is a, a fairly strong uh, dreadnought. It uh, it will put some damage out there, especially when things get close. I do like the Tesla chart because it, even though it, it, it kind of does the same thing when things get close, it, it zaps them and it doesn't do like everybody. Uh, it's it's a longer range, which is nicer. That machine guns. So this game, like uh, with a lot of the bullet heaven games that I've been playing lately. Uh, it's, you know, it's just organized chaos. Uh, it's, you know, back to the, 
the the druid you know everquest you know uh kiting the you know diablo type you know oh let's just try to run and put as many points as we can into things and uh same thing with you know everquest 2 and world of warcraft with you know kiting and i don't know why i just i always i had fun kiting like it was just like it was the puzzle that i'm trying to figure out and try to make work like i have the pieces and they may not supposed to work that way but hey you know it, it makes me happy still i do the same thing with uh, diablo uh my favorite character is the witch doctor uh and uh mostly the uh the the uh zoo pet build where you just get as many as many uh pets as you can and then i always build it with uh added oh that's not what i wanted that thing's kind of garbage uh i wanted uh the locust swarms and stuff like that to just throw as many dots as i can out and uh i find it relaxing which is funny because like this game like uh and insect swarm also but insect swarm's not really you're never really Depending on how you build your, your character, you're never really in danger of like getting getting killed. Uh, in the beginning, there's there's some some hairiness, but once you kind of get a couple of runs under your belt and get a couple of points into you, uh, it, you you're gonna start destroying that game pretty quickly. Uh, so you know it, it's 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 not as stressful. Like uh, there's uh, what is that? The, there's another game. Uh, uh, oh, now I gotta think. Um, Ultra C plays it a lot. Uh, damn it. They're trying to murder me and I can't think. Uh, yeah, it'll come to me as soon as I stop trying to remember it. Uh, but it's, it's a spaceship one, like where you fly around, you get upgrades. It's another rogue flight uh, where you, you, know, you get, you know, you get, actually, that one's more rogue-like, uh, yeah, not like because I don't think there's better in that one. Um, so, the uh, but that one, there's just too much crap going on on the screen, and it just, it, it hurts my brain to play it, and I just, I get, I get too panicked, and too, it, it just, there's too much stuff going on, and for me, and it's that game's not fun. I, I love watching people play it. I just don't like playing it. Uh, matter of fact, I bought it uh, mostly because I watched so many YouTube's on it, and I have so much fun watching other people play it that I, I bought the game just to, to <laughs> get the developer a little bit of money too, to say you know kind of thank you to them. Uh, but I just yeah I, I can't. I've, I've tried that game several times. The same thing with, uh, uh, what was it? Uh, Undermine? Uh, Undermine was another one I tried to play. I just, I could, I, there's just too much going on. Um, now that I've played this one for a while, I may try those again to see if, uh, See if I train my brain a little bit better to, to play them. Maybe maybe I'll be all right with them now. Uh, but I think the one the, the the space one. The other problem with that one is is these like your character always stays in the middle. So I just have to focus on where my character is. I don't have to focus on where my character is. I just have to focus on kind of like where the enemies are and then make sure I'm firing in the right right direction. Whereas with uh, it is going to bother the crap out of me. I'm going to have to go link it up in a minute. Uh, but the, the problem with that one is if you... Uh, you can go off the edge of the map. And it will warp you around to the other side. And when you do that, it, the, my brain... I, I just lose where I'm at. And my brain just is like, nope, I'm done. It's like... And then your character... Your, like this, you have this big, nice, you know... Egg robot in the middle of the screen, right? 
Uh, whereas with, uh, damn it. Uh, it, all right, it's, it's bothering me too much. Where's my stick? Uh, damn it, what is the name of that game? I'm gonna go to Ultra C's page real quick. Uh, Nova Drift. That's the name of it. Uh, so with Nova Drift, uh, the, the the ship is so small, and the it's everything's moving so fast. Uh, those guys play that game, and they're very very good at it. And I know there's people that are that are better better at it than they are uh, but the uh they they do very well so now that being said if you guys have other bullet heaven or bullets games uh they i want me to try like oh geez, i'm just gonna run away. oh that oh jesus run away why why do you guys hate me so much what did i do uh, if there's other Bullet Heaven, Bullet Swarm games that y'all would like to see me try, uh, if if there's you know enough call for it, like I don't care, I'll I'll go buy, especially indie games. Like I'll go buy an indie game, and like I don't I don't have a prop supporting an indie developer at all, uh, because the uh, I, indie developers, you know, they're they're taking chances, they're trying something new, and could sometimes just playing the game uh is is enough to just go okay this and it, they don't always work i'm not always you know they're not always my favorite games to play uh but it's always nice to see something different done uh, and that alone sometimes is, is worth the price of admission like hell even we played muck the other day uh on uh, we streamed that and Honestly, for for a game I went into not really thinking I was going to be a happy, you know, be super happy about playing it, uh, I was very, very pleasantly surprised. I was very happy with it. Uh, it's a free game, a survival builder type game. Uh, I, I was worried about the graphics, and by the time we got into it and actually started playing for a while, it was such a such a good game and just laughed and had a good time and just just good fun so and i honestly when it was originally suggested that we play that game that day uh i almost just disregarded it because of the graphics uh, but i'm trying to do things slightly differently um I, I i'm trying to get back and and into uh, being more worried about have fun and yeah I, I, I want to make good content I want to have good streams I want to have you know interaction and, and build a community and stuff like that but it's also important that I get back to have fun and get back to the reason I started streaming and and started wanting to do this and build build you know stuff on YouTube and, and things like that so it's important to uh they're just not happy with me today. Hey, all right, listen here, you stupid penguins. Um, the uh, so trying to to do new things and trying to figure out because we had uh, if you guys have been around for a while, uh, you know, as we played some other games, uh, we've had some very very bad luck uh, with. Uh, AAA games, especially, that have come out in the last few years that uh, did not live up to what we hoped they would. Uh, you know, if we go back, you know, we had um, Fallout 76. We had uh, a lot of people called, said Cyberpunk 2077. I was actually okay with Cyberpunk 2077. It ran fine for me. I didn't have 
clear the, the problems and the bugs that a lot of people had. Uh, so for me, it wasn't nearly as bad of a problem um, as some people. Uh, so I, I don't count Cyberpunk 2077 as a, as a failure. Uh, other than now we're losing, we don't get multiplayer because it, it didn't sell, the sales weren't, weren't as good as it, they could have been, uh, which sucks. Um, but then you go into, uh, the, the list goes on and on. Like uh, even, even, uh, Forza Horizon 5, when it came out, like I, it, it's just, I don't know. Oh geez, I am going to die very soon. Um, it, it just doesn't capture, it doesn't grab me as much. Like, I really went into it wanting to be captured and wanting to play the game a lot, and it just, it, it, did, it didn't hold my attention. Uh, I, I, I don't feel the need to want to log in every day and try to get the extra cars, and like, because a lot of it is, it's just regurgitated, and it's, you know, it's the next iteration where they're, oh, look, hey, we brought cars back. Um, and I, I know it sounds like I'm complaining. I'm just, and I don't mean to be like, oh my lord, how could you do this to me? Um, like, it, it's easy for me to sit here in my little chair and on the internet and pretend on YouTube that, you know, making games is easy. I, I know they're not. I know, know it's difficult. Um, but then we get other games like uh, Saints Row, which that game is just busted on so many levels and the uh, it's just bad, one bad decision after another in that game uh, where the uh, they just it, it's it's buggy it's broken it's crap the characters are garbage and I don't I don't mean like the characters are garbage because I don't I don't like their premise the characters are garbage because they have no uh, they have no meat to them. There, there's nothing there. Like, there's no depth to the character. They're just these, just cardboard cutouts of of what somebody thinks that you know the internet want, wanted the character to be. There's no backstory. There's hi, Cinders. Yeah, I know. How are you doing? Yeah, your life is horrible. I know it. I'm trying to murder things. You're not help. Oh God, you're not. You're really not helping. You want to wine? No. Um, and it, it's just horrible. Uh, then we had uh, before that we had a, a game called Dual Universe, which some people may have heard of, some people may not have heard of. Uh, I put a lot of I backed that one on Kickstarter a long time ago. I put a lot of money into it and hoping that it was going to be good. And we got into the beta and. We were playing the living crap out of it. We were doing really, really well with it. And then they basically took all the fun of the game, of the the industrial building side of it, and nerfed it so badly that they just it, it just sucked the fun out of it. Uh, and it, it made me so mad that they just refused to listen to the the uh, the player base so much that it just like just such a bad taste in my mouth that we just we just left i just folded up and left um and so i still have my account over there i log into it every couple of days because i paid a lot of money for it so i'm gonna log in every couple of days to make sure i'm getting all my skill points and make sure that you know if they ever do fix it so that the industrial part is fun again uh, then I'm able to get back in. I'll, I'll have a bunch of points saved. But holy crap, they, this has not gone well. Um, so you know, and it and it sucks because as a as a gamer and as a streamer and you know somebody that that you know my my goal is to eventually play video games for a living, right? Uh, it's it's hard because I put a lot of I I tie a lot of happiness and. Uh, things like that to uh, to games that that are coming out, and especially games that, that I'm excited about coming out, right? Uh, especially games from from a long time ago that I, that I'm looking forward to. And uh, so, when you bring out a beloved franchise like Dual or uh, uh, Tanks Row, 
I put a lot in that because I love Saints Row. Like the original Saints Row, I had so much fun with it. And I was, I was actually really happy they were bringing it out. And I was kind of happy that they were updating it and like, you know, they were going to change it and, and modernize it and stuff like that. And it's just like, I, I would have been okay with the characters all being, you know, gigantic douches, uh, or, you know, just pros and, you know, whatever. Like just completely over the top characters because that's what Saints Row has always been is just these over the top characters, and they just like they, it was like they were like oh hey we're gonna make these over the top characters but and then at the last moment they're like oh this is too much we can't we, we can't go that far somebody will be upset we'll, we'll you know like come on man all right so back to the beginning we did not get to the boss. Need to get pumping points in. Maybe I should go back to uh, back to one of the other ones and just do uh, uh, maybe I should go to either the desert or maybe I'll just go to the desert just do hyper mode. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure why, uh, um, I'm not entirely sure why, oh, I just lost my train of thought. Uh, you know, I haven't done a siege cannon really yet. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll try a siege cannon. And now I hit the wrong button. That was dumb. <laughs> oh, good. XT right on the beginning. Uh, let's go with a gravity reactor. Gravity reactor is uh, usually a good thing to do. Do Tesla turret. We got a crap load of reloads, so put some a drone pod in. So if you guys are coming in and hanging out, I do appreciate it. Uh, and if you're looking for, you want me to try some weird build or something, I I, I just I want to play the game. I want to learn, you know, kind of see what the game has involved in it. I want to see what it's capable of uh so a lot of that stuff is is trying different things uh trying to get some points built up so that we can get uh you know more skills kind of maxed out in the beginning what are you doing you're Oh, uh, I'm I'm not getting the therapist. Nope, not happening, buddy. Uh, nope, I don't want that one. Uh, we'll go with the drone pod for the center. Why not? We'll start getting the drone maxed out. I think if you get the drone maxed out, I mean, it's just like pony freaking drones that are just all zipped around. The only problem with the drone is they they almost seem to fly off screen and uh. Kind of, why are you over here again? What are you? No, you are not a lapdog, Cinder. You're not a lapdog. Hey, 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 hey! You are not helping me right now. You are not helping me. I love you, but you're not helping me. Uh, missile launchers. I'm not a fan of the missile launcher. The auto turret's okay. Speaks damage, I like. And I, I have, uh, I have videos of, uh, uh, I think we're past the feet cannon now. Oh. 
I'm just gonna burn rerolls until I find something good. Uh, we, we can go with a magnet. That's fine. I I will allow the magnet. Evidently, I'm allowing the magnet again. I figured the further away I can pick stuff up, the better off we are. The other game uh, is uh, Run Build Q. Um, I'm, and uh, the other one that I was looking forward to is uh, Cosmoneer. Or Cosmoteer. Um, I will probably be picking that one up. I'm waiting for Payday. Uh, I, I would have obviously just tried to, you know, if the developers had sent me a key for it, I would have definitely played that one for it. Because I've been looking forward to that one for a long time, uh, but uh, I don't I don't usually reach out like I don't send a lot of emails to uh, developers. Like I do have a uh, a Keymailer account, uh, and and I've requested keys on there before. Uh, I don't get a lot of keys on there because obviously I'm I'm not a large channel, uh, and usually the larger you are, the the better off you get there. Uh, so since I'm still a fairly small channel, uh, I don't get a lot of stuff through Keymuller. Not a lot of stuff I want anyway. I do, I do get a lot of random garbage that, uh, I, I reject. Uh, cause whether it's free or not, uh, I, I, you know, especially if it's unsolicited and, uh, you know, it looks like a, a mobile, a mobile phone port onto PC. Uh, I, I, I reject those <laughs> just as a, as a general rule, I, I reject those. Uh, I'm not, I'm not doing, uh, doing that stuff. And, uh, the uh, group of people that are going into the dark, looking for people of notoriety. Uh, I refuse to say the name of that game anymore. Uh, the the people that uh, I, I don't care how much money you guys offer me, uh, you, you're going to have to offer me literally so much money that uh, it would buy a, a wing at a hospital, like because that that would be the only way that I would accept money for that to, to promote that game. Uh, would be uh, if if I could donate an extremely large amount of money to Extra Life, and I I would have to basically be able to say, look, these guys are paying me a exorbitant amount of money to to tell you guys to go download this for Extra Life, um, and that would be the only way I would do. And even then, it would have to be a ridiculous amount of money. Because I am not a fan. But that goes for pretty much most monetization schemes. Anything that you do proprietary, or not proprietary, but anything that you do that's, uh, I wonder if pulse rifle maybe we don't we haven't tried the pulse rifle on this guy. Let's do that. I'm gonna try the pulse rifle. Um But yeah, my integrity and my, my honesty and being able to tell people up front exactly what's going on is more important to me than than the amount of money that you can pay me. I I re removed several opportunities for myself. Uh, and the channel for that because it's just it's not worth it to me whatever it is at the end of the night i still have to be able to sleep i i still have to wake up in the morning and look myself in the mirror i guess it won't, i guess i'll just do auto turrets I'm just gonna do auto turrets we'll just drop the auto turret down start level on them up Because look, turrets and a microphone. 
I guess it'd be two Tesla turrets and a, and a drone launcher. <laughs> Bonus points if you know where that one's from. So, if you guys have made it this far into the video, or into the, the stream, or if you're watching the VOD afterwards, hi, Singer. Uh, I am obviously Plum Yeti. Uh, we've been we've been around for seven years now uh, over on Twitch. Uh, my YouTube channel has been around since 2016. Uh, I uh, I uploaded a bunch of videos. Uh, well, not a bunch of videos. A few videos back then uh, when I first started. Uh, basically, a bunch of indie indie games, uh, and I, I still have the same passion and love for indie games and helping small developers where I can uh, help the big game that we're playing right now is Fortress Craft of All which is definitely an indie game uh, and uh, so I started uploading game, our videos on YouTube back in 2016 uh, I had an issue uh, with a game called Dumb Wars uh, where the developer had reached out to me uh, asked me to, to play their game on stream because they, they needed somebody to play it to basically test it and uh, give them some feedback uh, and you know so we worked out that and you know I got a key to it we got you know I, I don't want to say we worked out a deal because there was no deal like they gave me a key I played their game like it's it is what it is um, but we had all the permissions everything to do it we had permissions to stream it matter of fact the, the uh, developers were sitting in the, the chat with us um, when we streamed it and then uh, I got three DMCA strikes from one, or copyright strikes in one video. Um, and it, it just, like, at the time, like, I was brand new to YouTube, and I thought, like, I was like, oh, my God, three strikes, or three. At the time, I think they were just copyright claims, so I don't even think it was that bad of a deal. Um, but, like, here I am, brand new. It's, like, the fourth or fifth video I uploaded, and I've got basically in my mind three strikes um and if i if i tried to, to fight them then you know they're gonna shut my account down and like i just i just spent you know a bunch of money on uh my my computer to start the channel and so i i started panicking and, and freaking out and got got really upset and then uh decided that in my infinite wisdom that if youtube was going to to assign me unfair DMCA strikes. Uh, I was going to not upload to YouTube anymore because that would show them. Uh, so I took a took a break. We went straight to Twitch. Uh, and I, I basically, I learned my lesson. Like I, I stopped. And that's the reason with games, I don't listen to in-game music anymore. Even if the developer tells me, no, no, it's fine, it's fine. Like, I, I'm done. Like, I don't listen to in-game music anymore. Uh, and and even with that game, normally I didn't listen to end game music, uh, but that game you you kind of had to uh, because uh, the the game was tied to the 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 music. So if you didn't listen to the music, then uh, you couldn't play the game basically. And when we talked about it beforehand. Uh, they, I was assured that yeah, they had all the copyrights and everything, and it was just a, and it's the same thing right now. But right now, I have four, four copyright claims on my account right now, uh, from the last two live streams we do, and I'm, I'm I have a feeling I'm probably gonna end up with another one from this one, uh, because Pretzel Rocks has got a couple of, of songs, uh, in the YouTube safe portion of it right now. Uh, that are, I think, being false, they're being falsely flagged. Um, so I've already reported them, um, and I have, but at least now I have more of a recourse to do that. So that brings me to my next step, or my next uh, next point. If you guys are a streamer, and you're making YouTube videos, whatever you're doing, and you're looking for music, go check out Pretzel Rocks. Like, seriously, they, they're, they're really good. Uh, if you're streaming on... Uh, uh, there, there's a free option. Uh, there's, there's certain things you have to do uh, that basically will allow them to, uh, to do 
to, to do the free option, you have to basically allow their bot to announce the name of the song in the chat. Uh, and they're, they're, but please go read read the actual information of what they what you need to do. Uh, they're very good guides. They'll walk it right through it. Oh, I'm not I'm not at work. <laughs> um, so they, they'll walk you through kind of getting the bot set up, getting the permission set up for your for your Twitch and stuff like that. Um, and then basically. Or you can just pay the money for the account, and then if you pay the money for the account, you don't have to have the bot basically save the information. Uh, when I stream on Twitch, I do both. I pay for it, and I, I have the bot tell it. Is that a way of... Sinners, why? I, okay, look here, Mrs. Claw Machine. That hurts me. Like, I don't know what is going on. Why are you licking my hand all of a sudden? What is going on? Why? Oh, I'm getting killed because I'm petting you. Um, but Pretzel is, is really cool. There's a link down in the description. Uh, go check it out. Uh, like I said, it, it, there's a bunch of different stations. I listen to the EDM because I, I like EDM music. Uh, I like, I've listened to techno and house and industrial and stuff. And I don't know why it just, as chaotic and as, as crazy as it is, it, I, I, it's just calming to me. Like, it's, it's so weird. Um, but I, I like, uh, the EDM music, uh, which I'm sure probably doesn't, uh, it, it probably turns some people off, but whatever. I like EDM, so that's, that's what we're listening to. Um, the, uh, but, so Pretzel's there, down there, so please go check them out. Uh, also, if y'all do see the lights in the background, uh, I'm still working on trying to get that stuff all working in YouTube. I don't know. I, I think I need to figure out what the actual uh, commands are that it's trying to use and make sure people have the correct commands set up. Um, I thought I could do other commands because like I have, um, I think it's that. But that one doesn't work. But but Howl does, I think. No, it's not working. Oh no! Oh, there it goes. It's just it takes a little bit of time. Um. So the uh, basically uh, it allows me to do that. But like, but then Jaws doesn't work I don't know uh, I don't know if I want to try that one um, so I, I don't know why like some of them are working and other ones aren't so I need to go figure out what I've I, I've obviously set something up wrong or something's not set up correctly but it's a it's a really cool program too uh, it also has a free version to it uh, it reduces the amount of stuff you can do uh, but it does work uh, as a free version if you want to check it out uh, I will say if uh, you are looking at trying to do something like that uh, uh, check it out uh, check out the free version first uh, there are restrictions on the type of lights you can use uh, and not every light you can use does show up there. So uh, I have some Tuya lights. Uh, I have a bunch of Tuya lights that aren't necessarily made by, or well, they're made by Tuya, but they're not uh, sold as Tuya lights. They're sold by a third party. Tuya is like the main manufacturer and that people license and sell or use their software to build their controllers. Um, it's a bunch of technical bumpo jumbo. Uh, if you guys really are interested in it, come over to the Discord, come hang out, come ask questions. I'll do my best to answer them for you, or we'll find the answer for you. Uh, so, uh, but uh, there, there's a there's a whole list on the website, and obviously the link's down in the description for that one also. Uh, And you can do a lot of, of really cool effects and you know changes and streams and stuff like that. Uh, I have it set up so uh, I, I'll be adding more and more stuff to it. I'm trying to get the things set up so that uh, 
I can bring some of the Twitch functionality for like channel points and stuff like that over. Uh, it's it's not going to be the the best ever uh, because I, I I don't think I'll be able to restrict it the way we can, which means that the uh, the items we have to give things to the uh, canines uh, may not actually make it over. Uh, in the form that it is right now because I, I have to restrict that uh, Because what ends up happening is people abuse it and then uh, I end up being an entire bag of treats for the dogs in a day Which is not good for them, and I don't actually do that uh, But uh, Like I, I don't want to Because it'll, it'll make them sick like it's just it's just not good for them um, So uh, you know, I don't know if the that particular thing will, will come over, uh, but we'll try to do our best to get what we can of other ones, of different ones to bring over. Uh, at least I'm trying to, the new one I'm trying to set up now is uh, a way for people to kind of say hi to the, to the chat when they come in. Um, and trying to, different ways to do that. And okay, this may not end well. I need to get I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get over there to see that thing. I'm just gonna get all the just get a bunch of damage. Alright, there's that. So that will at least help me. Hopefully you get come on, come on, come on, come on. Nope. Oh, that's the first time I've had to, to exit that the circle. So, oh, geez, I'm not, I'm dead. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, if this, I'm done. There's, there, that, that wasn't. Uh, so Lumia streams down there. Also, other ones we have are it's humble sum, humble bundle uh, is also down there. It's all it's for different things that I picked up, uh, different affiliates that that I feel confident in, in trying to sell. Uh, now the other side too, uh, if you guys have made it this far uh, over on Twitch, uh, Twitch TV slash Pump Yeti, uh, November fifth and November sixth from eight a.m. to eight p.m. Central Standard Time, uh, we'll be up and live stream. Uh, for an extra life game day uh, and we'll be just trying to cause massive amounts of damage and uh, uh, we're going to be playing Fortress Craft the Wall trying to kill the bugs off and raise some money for, for Texas children uh, we'll be giving games away we'll be doing all kinds of crazy stuff so come over, hang out in the stream come say hi uh, I greatly appreciate it what is it, why are you roaring at me all right, we're gonna try alabaster this time. Uh, give us, give us something, something slightly different to play with. Kind of break it up a little bit. Why are you, why are you being so needy today? What is, what is going on? What are you doing? <laughs> no! Cinder, you are hurting me! Hey! What are you doing? You are hurting me! Why are you hurting me? <laughs> Can I help you? What? You're hurting me again! No, you're hurting me! Hey! Can you please go... Would you please get off of me? That hurts where you're standing. Hey, come on. Would, would you stop it? Okay, enough. Enough. Go sit down. No, go lay down. I gave you pets. I gave you loves. There are more pets and loves. There it is. I know. I love you. I'm trying to do stuff. 
You are not, you are not cooperating. I've told you about this, that if you would learn how to play video games, we would be doing a lot better. Yeah, if you stand around and play video games all day long, yeah, the channel would be doing so much better. Trust me. No, you don't, you get no thumbs, I know. All right. Can I go back to what I'm, can I go back to work? Can I go back to doing what I'm doing now? Do I have your frame registry? Is it okay? No. All right. Super. Go lay down. What you? What are you doing? Get out of my gummy bears! <laughs> so Cinder, Cinder's uh my black lab. She's uh. He's a rescue. We we think she's black lab, uh, mostly because uh, she well she looks like a black lab and she has a uh, web web paws, uh, which is a uh, black lab things. Uh, and then with the ears and everything, we're pretty sure that she has uh, a, a good amount of German Shepherd in her also. He he's actually a really good dog. He just thinks that she's a, a lap dog uh, because if if it fits, she sits. Uh, and doesn't doesn't really care what I have to say about it. <laughs> it's obviously I, I I don't know what I'm talking about when I tell her uh, it it doesn't it doesn't work. Oh, who tests the quills this time? All right. Uh, reloading belt. Uh, maybe faster. I like faster. Oh, let me go get that. That's more armor. I like armor. So the trick with this guy is, is uh, he has armor, but you have to go pick up his armor from around four. Uh, and kind of level him up. Uh, true, but I don't. The the laser, the laser in theory sounds good. Um, uh, but the uh, in, in practice, it's I don't know. It's just another like on on a Benedict. Uh, it does okay because he with the auto aim it's just a bunch it's just massive amounts of damage in that, that direction uh, but uh, pretty much anybody else uh, it, it's just it's wherever you're pointing at it's just you know yeah it's more more straight line damage uh, but sometimes trying to get stuff to fast enough to cause damages or get the damage on the you know hits on target, uh, it's difficult sometimes. We'll just burn some re-rolls. We got enough. Let's do that. Okay, why? What is going on? <laughs> Damn it, I did it again. Okay, no, ow. Okay, no, stop. Okay, now that is actually really hurting bad. Okay, would you stop digging your claws into my skin? You were killing me, dog. Literally killing me. And what happens is because I sit over here and talk to myself for a while, and she's figured out that uh, if I'm sitting over here talking to myself, then I'm I'm probably streaming. And if I'm streaming, and she keeps sticking her face in the in the screen, then people sometimes push a button, and I have to open a box. 
Uh, what she hasn't realized is on YouTube, I don't have that button for people to press. Uh, and I have it set up for, for people to be able to press that. But, you know. Oh, look, the train. I'll eventually get all my armor. The shotgun is definitely uh definitely helpful. There's one of them. I think it starts it starts with a shotgun. I think it can have four shotguns by the time you're done with them. Maybe maybe we'll do him do that one next. His four shotguns on that guy is it, it's it's a bit overpowered. You can actually pull off four shotguns. It, it's a lot of damage. No, 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 no. Is this the last piece I remember? I think I got one more. Oh, Galaxy Armor Complete. Okay, now if I can find the Crystal XD. Crystal XT right now would be great because uh, the extra speed would be, or not the extra, or the, the pickup of everything. Because there's quite a bit of stuff that I miss running around, running for my life. <laughs> I'll take the damage from that one. It's fine. It's fine. Uh, let's do, we'll do Kim Tanks. Kim Tanks is good. <laughs> yeah, okay. That, that will probably help. Me. Being able to pick up stuff from further away. Oh, I it's helpful. Uh, yeah, we're not doing Cerebus. I tried Cerebus, like, I, I don't know. I don't think it's... Anything that just randomly strikes a spot, and you just kind of have to hope that something's in the way of to catch it with its face, uh, I don't know if it's the best option. I'm sure I'm sure there's a way it works awesome. And it may be it may be worth the because uh, I know there's a guy that has four of them, so it may be interesting to see what happens if you put like four uh Cerebus on you. Uh maybe maybe we'll try that at some point tonight too. To see if we can get a uh I think there's a, a guy that has four side launchers on it. I don't remember what they're actually called. Uh, secondaries. So there's a guy with four secondaries. So maybe try to get him and load four Cerebus. See what happens. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, more shotgun. More shotgun, I like it.
Here, let me let me turn this thing off real quick. This is gonna start making a lot of noise. <laughs> so i do want to say thank you to everybody so far that has come into the channel or coming well i keep calling it a channel but into the uh into i guess it is still a channel uh but into the youtube page uh that that's a sub that's that's you know watch the videos and, and stuff like that and the feedback and the comments and everything that i've been receiving i do really appreciate it uh like i said i have been doing uh, twitch for seven years or so now uh, i put a lot of work and effort into trying to, to stream uh, i'm trying to to learn the uh uh, you know, the video editing and stuff like that. Uh, I, I, the video editing is hard for me. It, it's, it's, it's a different thing and trying to cut stuff out. I, my problem is, is I, I think everything's important and I, I'm afraid to cut something out because I'm afraid somebody might want to, to look at it or that, you know, if I, if I cut a jump, if there's a jump cut in it, you know, that, uh, I, I'm afraid somebody's gonna be like, "Oh, what was there? What was that edit for?" And I don't know why I do that. I don't know why. I, it's it's a mental thing on my part. It's it, and it's just excuses. Uh, so I guess at some point I'm just gonna have to try to do it. Um, I do have an editor lined up, uh, and she is looking to help us uh, by by editing a lot of that stuff out for us. Uh, but uh, she had some health issues that popped up at the last second. And uh, so I told her that uh, I'm a lot more worried about her health than I am about an edited video. Uh, so uh, as soon as the videos can start being edited and stuff like that, uh, we'll, we'll try that out, see how people, see how those do. Um, and then it, it's all it's all experiments. It's all trying to figure things out. It's all trying to to see what works and what doesn't and as we as we try to figure out this this crazy game called YouTube uh, and but the important part is is for us to have fun and have a good time you know the community and you know try to figure out how to make things work uh, because we got to do something The uh, so and the reason I, I I ramble a lot, especially when I when I chat and and uh, talk about things, especially with uh, stuff that's going on with the channel and stuff that's going on uh, behind the scenes. Uh, I do a lot of sharing. I do a lot of transparency because I do know I want, I want people to know what's going on. Uh, so the uh, the sudden change for a push to change stuff. The reason we we're on YouTube now. The reason we're starting. The reason I'm pushing on YouTube uh, is because I I had some life stuff that happened in the beginning of the year I uh, end up having to take a lot of time off uh, and I've had to do that a, a few times over the years uh, and the things I've had to take off like basically make it where I can't stream but I would have been able to release a video uh, like I, I, I could have probably released a video edit it you know, put, pull some stuff out and probably have done okay uh, because I can do a lot shorter formats on YouTube than I can on uh, Twitch. Because on Twitch, if you're if you're going to stream for less than three hours, for the most part, it's not even worth it. Um, like, it, it just it, it's just the the name of the game over there, right? Uh, and that's why when I do streams over here on YouTube, I I stream for four or five, you know, six hours. Uh, I basically stream as long as I'm happy about it, and then once once I start kind of running out of things to do, or uh, the stream starts suffering from, oh, we, you guys are not happy about this situation, are you? Uh, I, I would like to go away now. Um, yeah, you guys are not, no, no. Um, 
So, so that's why the streams are here. However, the streams being you know that long uh, definitely don't necessarily work the best on YouTube, um, as as far as I've noticed. Uh, it's the the you know when you're live, yeah, people come in, they'll hang out for the whole time, they'll, they'll say hi, and, you know, lurk and listen to my 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 voice and as background noise, which I'm fine with. If you want to come lurk, I'm okay with you coming to lurk. Like, please come lurk like one. Uh, the, uh, but the, uh, basically if I'm not actively live on, on Twitch, the channel over there is not growing. If I have to take, you know, five months off because I had a family emergency come up and I need, I need time, uh, then the channel grows absolutely none. Like there is nothing that happens. Uh, and if you're not growing, then, you know, why are you here? Uh, cause they, there, there's not a single person out there. And I, I don't, as far as I'm, I'm sure of as you know, nobody wants to see their numbers go down. Um, I try not to look at the numbers and, and try not to, to do that stuff, but you always want to feel like you're making progress. You want to feel like something with your work is the, the amount of work you're putting in is, is got some sort of payoff. Uh, and I'm, unfortunately on Twitch, I am not getting that, if that feeling right now, uh, I am not getting, uh, basically nothing going on. And then Twitch is, Twitch is, um, Twitch has done some stuff lately that has made, uh, made it easier for for me to go uh maybe i should should look at other options too like don't get me wrong i'm not stopping twitch anytime soon um I, i'm gonna pe still be over there i'm gonna still be working oh wow i am i am not doing well um i, I i'm still looking at you know how to do things and, uh you know trying trying to get some sort of traction on Twitch, trying to do something to get some sort of uh, progress over there, also, um, because obviously, you know, it, all joking aside, any of these uh, streaming services, any of the, you know, YouTube, you can pull tomorrow. Uh, uh, if anything. Google and Alphabet has has proven to us uh, they have no problem cutting the cord on something and just being like, nope, we're done with this garbage. Uh, if you don't believe me, look at Stadia. Uh, Stadia, uh, they put a lot of money in that. And they were just like, nope. Uh, you know, look at look at Mixer. Obviously, it's not it's not Google. It's it's Microsoft. But Microsoft put a lot of money into into Mixer, and literally overnight was just like nope we're done and they closed the doors told everybody to have a good day and uh moved on with our life uh it's just it is what it is like so no, none of these sites are are bulletproof like you know hell tomorrow we could bring out a brand new version of you know something and you know elon musk could decide he wants to spend ridiculous amounts of money and, and just, you know, go to Microsoft and bring Mixer back and then sh just shut everybody down. I, I don't think that's going to happen, but, you know, like, who knows? Who knows what the future is going to hold? So, for me, uh, having all my eggs in one basket, uh, especially in a, in, a corp in a, you know, a bunch of corpo suits that don't care about me, <laughs> Like, and me trying to do some sort of brand loyalty to, to be loyal to them. Not, not optimal. Uh, I don't, I don't think it's a, it's a smart move on anybody's part. Uh, and whether you're on whatever platform you're on now, uh, I would recommend you to, to look at diversifying yourself also. Uh, because all joking aside, uh, these corporations, they don't care about us. They, they really, they don't care about us. Uh, and if, if you think that, you know, Google actually cares, like even, you know, 
about the ninjas and the doctor disrespects in the you know of the world uh like yeah they, i'm sure if you know they they leave a platform there there's a meeting and somebody's getting gonna, gonna get yelled at like you know for for that happening uh but they, they they're they're not gonna stop like they're not gonna you know Hell, Twitch Rickin basically kicked Doctor Disrespect off the off the platform, and he was one of the, the biggest names over there. You know, it's just you know, and now it's just it, it is what it is, right? So, if if as as long as the uh, you're making a money and you're pulling money in, and the controversy and the 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 headache is less than the you know the 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 profits on you. Then they're going to keep you. But as soon as as soon as the your cost is greater than their profits off of you, you're gone. Like they they don't care. Like and it makes sense, right? Like obviously, if you know, everybody's out for themselves, and I'm fine with that. I'm fine with a corporation looking out for their their best interest. If you know, uh, but at the same time, I'm, I need to go to where it's going to be best fit for me. Uh, and if you're you're a, a streamer or you're a, a, a viewer or a whatever you should go to the best place for you whatever that is so a lot of me trying to go into youtube and go into twitch going into these different things is to uh, give people options of the best place for them to watch the content uh, so the, the my mindset my mind change lately has been okay well if people want to watch me on x platform why the hell am i not on x platform if they want to watch me on Y platform, who am I to tell them that I'm not going to be on Y platform because I don't like it? Uh, or that, you know, at some ultra sense of motive of, oh, well, you know, I, I've got some codependent freaking relationship with, with a, a streaming service. Um, I have to, I have to stay loyal to them. So it is, it's one of those things that when you kind of wake up and you realize that uh, if you're in a codependent relationship, uh, then it's it's time to make a change. And trust me, I've been in plenty of them to, to realize when I'm in one. Okay, well, this is going to be fun. I think I'm gonna. I don't know. Maybe this way. This way may be the best way to go. I don't. I don't think. I don't think there's a good way to go. Uh, I'm gonna try to get. Uh. Well, we're up to eleven drones now. We'll eventually get a few more drones, or we'll get the the evolution for them. They are they are definitely putting out some some damage now. Uh, yeah, let's 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 just keep. I do like that times two damage. That thing that thing. It does work. And honestly, like for especially the perks, I I would rather the time two times two damage than the other one. That lasts for 70 seconds. Because the 70 second one is like, oh, that's great, but it's 70 seconds and it wears out. Alright, now it's starting to get to the point where there's too much stuff on the screen. It's, my brain's breaking again. <laughs> I never said I was good at these games. I just said I enjoyed them. But yeah, so... Um, like I said, I do a lot of, of talking about what's going on and, you know, why and, and what and and how and, and what's going on. Uh, if you guys are interested in more behind the scenes stuff and you want to send me information, Discord link's down down there. Uh, I, I pretty much try to stay and answer stuff on there as, as, as quickly as I can. Uh, and uh, try to... We have special rooms in there too that if you are a streamer and you have questions about setting things up or you know why why you should come over here you know 
or why you should go to YouTube, why you should go to Twitch. Like if you're a YouTube only guy and or, or gal, uh, and you know you're like, oh, I'm I'm YouTube ride or die. Like honestly, like don't like seriously. If you you have the idea at, at the least bit to go over to you or to Twitch to stream, or if you've streamed on on YouTube, you should be streaming on Twitch also. Uh, set up, set up, and get over there and get some. Get get your foot in the door. If something happens, if another ad apocalypse happens, if you know something happens where your livelihood is threatened over here, like get your foot in the door, get some information, or you know get, you know, so you have another revenue stream. Especially if you're trying to, to, uh, like don't get me wrong, like I don't count on on revenue uh, for video games at all. Uh, but it would be nice to, uh, at some point, like, don't get me wrong. I, I don't know if it's possible for me to, to, you know, quit my day job. Uh, and I don't plan on quitting my day job anytime soon. I, I enjoy my day job. I really do. Uh, I, I have, you know, good coworkers. I have, uh, you know, I, I enjoy it. I get to fix computers and, and I work in customer service and, and I solve problems for people. And for me, that's, that's awesome. I love, I love the job and I love doing it. Um, uh, you know, so that being, you know, it is what it is. And I, I enjoy my job. However, uh, my contracts change, like different people gets the contract. And when the contract changes, I'm not guaranteed a job. Uh, so if I'm not guaranteed a job, uh, you know, that means, you know, the new company coming in, you know, if, if they don't talk to us early enough or whatever, or something happens, like I've got to make plans for myself. Uh, so at this point, I'm trying to make it where if, uh, if they want to play games and come in at the last second, you know, and try to, to low ball me or whatever, if I have an alternate choice as, you know, you know what? Maybe the YouTube stuff is, is looking like a, a decent plan you know, or, you know, whatever. So I just, I, I want to have a backup plan. So if something happens, like I get laid off again, because I've been laid off once in my life, that's done. Uh, so I, I, I don't like it. I, I, I want to have a backup plan. So, and, and I guess that's really what I'm trying to say is, you know, whatever you're doing, wherever you are in your life, always have a backup plan. Always have something in the wings that you're looking out for you and you're looking out for your own. Uh, because uh, these the corporations aren't going to look out for you. Your boss at your work, and some bosses kind of look out for you, but there's only there's only so much they can do. Like they can't do everything, right? Like a, your boss, it, you know, can't you know bend the rules and give you special favors, and that push comes to shove, and and they have to lay people off, you know, because sometimes it's you know literally it's it's you or them, uh, and if it's that comes down to that point. Your boss is going to have his own back. May not have your own back, right? Um, so you should always have a backup plan. You should always have a plan B. Uh, and you should always always be, be you know, have, have, have an escape plan. So, and right now, uh, the escape plan is, is kind of this. Uh, and hell, if nothing else, I figured by, you know, another 15, 16 years, if I'm still doing this stuff, uh, it'd be a nice retirement job. Like, uh, you know, I figured I got that many years to, to work on trying to get uh, retirement stuff set up. I can do that. Because I'm pretty sure, uh, oh, I wasn't paying attention and died. Too busy getting distracting on myself. Um, so, worst case scenario, like I said, at that time, you know, if I have retirement, I have I have my 401k, I have, you know, Social Security if I still exist. Um, you know, so I'd, I'd have that that stuff in, take care of my normal bills. I can do this for fun. Um, and, you know, an extra cheeseburger here now and then. That wasn't bad. So I think I've tried the four, four shotguns before. So let's go to the armory. Uh, let's go to the Cerebus. I'm going to max out the Cerebus as far as I can, which is all the way. Um, and then 
maybe put some more in here. That's good. I like that. More, more damage, damn it. What is this? Rate of fire. Uh, let's do that. AI core. Sure, let's do that too. All right, so let's go back and look at our new game. So this is... Um, damn it. Uh, let's see. Let's go back. Armory. So the Lazarus is the purple deck. So the so new game. Purple dash of two. Purple dash of six. And he comes with a shotgun. Uh, he, he that control scheme's a little a little special. Uh, you know what? Let's try it. So we'll we'll try to load two two shotguns, and see if we can get like six Jervis launchers on them. Uh, and just. Eh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. So th this is the best possible thing I can think of. Our best possible way to test the service to find out if it's really worth it or not. So, Cerebus straight off the bat. All right. So, I'm just going to do what I can to load as many Cerebus as I can. So, basically what the Cerebus does is it drops off in a, in a, a single, or there are four directions like that. Uh, so, we're going to go double shotguns straight out of, straight out of the go. So maybe I'll do. Uh, we can only have one of those. The Tesla. Tesla's not bad. Um, I can do Tesla. I was thinking of whether I should do Tesla or if I should do. Uh, the the uh, the ring thing. I definitely want that thing. Or Teslas. The only bad thing about this is that only, I'll only be able to evolve with only the Tesla. Oh wow, another train. Uh, so let's re-roll that because we have a bunch of re-rolls. Um, fire rate? Fire rate's probably a good thing to have. Since the shotgun uh is kind of this little fire the more shotgun shells is probably a good plan another pair of us so you see as you add it so now it goes off in uh eight directions instead of four so then the question is is it so what happens when i add what happens when i add uh what happens when i add another one Oh, so it double it doubles up the one that already had that that direction. That's not as good. Um, I don't know if I like that. Proof rate of fire, especially with a service. I think with the 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 rate of fire on that is probably helpful. Having that thing fire more often is probably a good thing. Therapist, damn it.
Uh, so that one, there's a little bit wider range on those. Oh, and they're kind of offset too. Okay, so that's why it looks like there's there's different because they're the they're offset firing. Uh, we don't need that one. Uh, we'll do another rate of fire. Now, the good thing is that Cerebus actually goes through that wall and kills things behind it, so... Good gravity. Another Cerebus. Yeah, so basically it's just it's a wall of, of blades now. Which isn't bad, but not good. Oh, I should, should look behind me. Nope, not going with the turret thing, so. I'm seriously just, I'm just going to max out the service all the way. So that is uh, six service. So basically all it's doing is it's it's still the the eight directions it's just now each each one of them is three blades so pretty much if something gets hit by that it's gonna kill it especially if it gets hit by all three of them uh, but it's still only eight directions like i would have been happier if they spread out uh, it would have been awkward with like an odd number though, like if I had three of them or something. You'd almost have to make uh, different patterns for, you know, how many you had. It is doing a lot of damage though, like it's it's straight burns and stuff. I don't know if it's me or the shotgun or... Yeah, it's 24 a, a pop. Like it, it's causing some damage. <laughs> I still don't know how I feel about it. I don't know if I, I super like it or not. But it does work. Another test of turret. So that way, if something does actually get close to me, <laughs> sucker fish. Get more shotguns. I think all, all the, so basically adding more points to it just does, yeah, so it's the same damage, it basically just causes it to fire faster.
But I'm not. They're all still firing. You no, know, uh, it looks like one of them's firing a little faster now. Maybe. Yeah. So all. Oh, so it, it turns them red. So it's. What the hell's it doing? It's like the red one's like. Oh, maybe the one on the bottom I just can't see. Okay, that makes sense now. That's cool. It turns it turns them different colors as as you level them up. Right, so now that one's all the way maxed out. So that's only thirty six damage, though I think. So if we do this one, so this one is 36 damage. So basically it's just 36 damage as opposed to 20. Uh, uh, I don't know. I don't know if I'm a fan of the Cerebus or not. Like, it's definitely doing work. Like, don't get me wrong on that. It's it's definitely murdering some things. But it's it's a lot harder to control uh, to try to figure out what you're murdering with it. And then the other problem, too, is with this guy, it's kind of a pain in the butt to try to figure out which direction he's going. Cause, so he's basically controlled with a WSAB. Because uh, I'm still using the keyboard because I'm an idiot. Um, so with the WSAD, I'm kind of pointing at, you know, uh, you know, you go here, you go here. So the control is like, and that's the good thing about this is there's so many different control schemes in this that, you know, they, they work, work well. Uh, so, you know, if, if you don't like one control scheme, you can try another one. Uh, with a different bot, and then it, with it having a different control scheme, you may like it more, uh, and then you may like the game more, and sometimes it's just trying to figure out which one you like. Um, and sometimes, you know, the one you think you may like, and the, the, your favorite one that you think is going to be your favorite one, maybe it isn't. Uh, so I would recommend at least trying all the different ones. And, you know, and that's why I, I bounce back and forth between the different ones, trying to figure out which one I want to use, which one I don't want to use, and trying to figure out how they, how they work. <laughs> how much long will we last? I'm starting to get angry now. We'll eventually get the, uh... Maybe I'll try to, uh, after the, this is done, maybe I'll, I'll download the video and try to at least edit the different, the different, uh, plays or different bots out so that we, uh, it makes it easier to figure out which one you want. I guess I could use the timestamps too, but, um. Uh, For some reason, people see like you know a two or three hour video on YouTube, and they're just like, "Ah, oh, I can't do it." <laughs> second, second, service, 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 service. I'm sick. It, it was cool. Like I, I'm glad I I'm glad I tried it. Um, I'm not not a huge fan of it. Um, I'm glad I tried it. Uh, so let's refund those. Uh, you know, I haven't tried the black cannon. I haven't tried the black cannon being maxed out. Let me try that. Maybe. Can I, can I, can I max that out? Uh, the flamethrower, I'm not a fan of either.
We've unlocked that. That. So maybe we'll try flat cannon and maybe laser blasters. I know there is one guy that starts with the the flat cannon, so maybe we'll start with with that one. A new game. The flat cannon. Sheep gun, pulse rifle, flame door shotgun. Oh, it's the Praetorian. Oh no, it's the Praetorian that starts with the flat cannon. I hate the Praetorian. All right, we're doing it. <laughs> I think the Praetorian is the one that fires behind him, uh, and I'm not a fan of it. It, it literally breaks my brain. So wherever you're pointing at, it actually fires the opposite direction. Uh, my brain is, it's not working. My brain is. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm glad it exists. Like, I, I'm glad. I, I am not, I can't, I can't, my brain's not working. Like just just the you know, make sure you don't point at what you're trying to hit freaking thing. It's just it, it it just breaks my brain. Like why isn't he shooting at what I want him to shoot at? Do I want to try lasers? No, because the lasers are going to fire out the back also. And they're going to freaking cause me to have brain damage. Um, it is not going to work. Uh, the auto turret may be a good alternative here. Because at least that I drop. And then it kind of fires at whatever's around me. Uh, yeah, so let's, we'll, we'll drop the, the auto turret. Like, th this guy would probably be better the, the longer you, uh, the longer you play this guy, probably, I'm sure, the better you do with him. So I'm just going to try to get, like, these guys where I'm uh, literally just throwing a lot of auto-targeting things. While my brain tries to wrap my coordination around trying to get this thing to work. Uh, the Cosmic Guardian, probably not a bad plan. Fire rate's probably not a bad thing. I don't think I'm going to take flat cannon unless. Oh, wait, no, I'm going to take hit points because I'm fixing to die. Yep. 
emergency shield. Yeah, the Praetorian is, like I said, and I said it before, like, I'm glad that the dev is kind of stuck to his guns and said, no, no, let's, let's at least think about it for a minute. Let's, let's do some, some thought process. I, I, I'm glad it's here. I'm glad it exists. Um, and I'm sure there's some people that could really use this thing to their the utmost advantage. I am not one of them. Uh, this, this mech literally breaks my brain. Like, it just trying to figure out, like, to, to get it to fire, you know, or basically have your cursor the opposite direction of where you're trying to go. Just, just hurts my head. Uh, uh, more faster isn't really gonna help me any. Uh, 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 I'm hurt. I don't think I can get out. Come on. I'm fighting. I'm fighting for it. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess I'll do try something else here in a minute. I would get speed, but I don't think speed's what I need right now. Damage, probably not a bad thing. Like, he puts out a lot of damage and, you know, he does as well. It's just that backwards thing is, oh, it makes my, oh, dead. It just makes my head hurt. So uh, he makes my head hurt. Uh, so this guy, what is? It's only got one. What's the E? Oh, that, that's the stuff in the middle, I think. You know, I haven't done this guy in a bit. I wonder what he would do because I think this is the one people were putting four shotguns on. I almost wonder what would happen with four machine guns now they get machine guns maxed out. Is this this was my 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 happiest uh, player or the the mech that I like the most uh, until uh, I got benefit. And then once I because the uh, trying to start with them originally was a huge pain in the butt because. Uh, the bullets were so slow coming out of it, uh, with the machine gun not being upgraded, that it just sucked. Uh, and normally with this guy, I would do a machine gun and three shotguns. Uh, but let's do something different. Let's just see, let's just load him full of machine guns and see what happens. Let's just, let's just, just DACA, just, just reloads. Let me do Cosmic Guardians. I'm, I'm, I'm going to maybe do two Cosmic Guardians. I haven't done like a, a hard, hard Cosmic Guardian in a, in a while, so. Maybe we'll try four machine guns and just cosmic darkness for days. Okay. 
reloads, I reload with some some desire. Man. Yeah, it sucks, especially when you have like uh, multiple other guns that all have the same reload speed. You you end up getting in a spot where they're like, oh, okay, well everything's reloading right now, so that's great. Please call back. You're caller number five. Yep, let's get the reload belt. It's not a bad thing to get. Anything that can knock that reload down. Like, the reload right now is, is bad. Eventually, it'd be okay. It, it, it would get a lot better. Uh, pulse rifle would be cool, but... And I want to, I'm just going to put four shotguns on it see what happens. Or not shotguns, four, uh, four miniguns. He just doesn't know it yet. And, uh, nope. Yep, I'll do the reloader. I think it'd be interesting to see what's going to happen with, with four miniguns on the front of this thing. Uh, what do I want to do for the sides? Not doing service. Uh, I'll try that. <laughs> oh, another mission done. Oh, good. Oh, so yeah. So it puts it inside. So it's basically it would be almost like a just a, a really confined shotgun because it's just gonna be like okay, whatever you are in there right now, just die like. Uh, machine gun. Call me Machine Gun Kelly. Nope, nope. I'm okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna sneak over here. Is that, is that cool, guys? Is that, is that all right? Oh, I should have went with lasers. Yeah, because then the lasers that would have been even more just straight, just straight out the front. Like it would just been a wall of wall of bullets yeah so it's just that's just a wall of just anger I like it I am a fan uh, no one uh, let's, let's go walking faster. I like walking faster. <laughs> I know it is possible to kill these guys. I've, I've done it before. See, it's, it's possible to kill them. You put enough shots on target. Uh, you can't, you can't make, clear a hole. Like, no, no, I'm going to go out this way. So, yeah, it, it is possible to kill those things, but it takes a lot of, of shots on target. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get as many of the machine guns. Oh well I guess just ten. Maybe we'll just try to get to ten.
it's just yeah that that bullet spray is is something fierce and the the lasers bounce also which is which is helpful especially when you get them all up in a pack like that where the, the laser can start bouncing it's adorable i love it yeah i should i should have went with with double lasers instead of the turret maybe i'll have to try another one uh maybe we'll do another one with this one this one's doing well so far i like it Just double double lasers, quad quad machine guns, and just bullet spray. It's just a fire hose of bullets. I love it. Like nope, just point at it. I want it dead. Too bad I can't put four of them on on Benedict. Like that would be. We can try to do, but I think I've done Benedict with two. I don't think I've done him with two machine guns and two lasers, though. <laughs> that, that may be a little bit interesting. So, uh, if you guys are watching this after the fact, uh, do me a favor. Uh, if y'all are, if you made it this far in, uh, seriously consider, you know, giving me a like, a subscribe, a follow, all that stuff. Um, I, I it, it helps, right? I'm trying to get over here and get set up and get set up on YouTube. Uh, my, my big push right now, honestly, and it's just, it's going to be one push after another. It, it doesn't matter. Like, no matter what, what goal we hit, there's always another goal. Uh, but the big goal right now is trying to get to a hundred subs, uh, and and the subs are such a weird arbitrary number. Like it's just like weird. Um, but and we need to get to a hundred subs so I can actually uh, name uh, the channel. Uh, so we have the a dedicated landing page as opposed to uh, uh, whatever whatever uh, alphabet soup. They, they want to give to me today. Uh, so I want to try to get a, the uh, the name reserve so we actually have our channel. Uh, we have that set up. So if you guys do me a favor and go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I do appreciate it. Uh, and every time uh, it just it makes me happy uh, because in the grand scheme of things uh, we're, we're actually seeing some progress over, over here on YouTube. And I, 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 I love it. I love, love making progress. And I think, I think everybody does so. So like I said, if you guys would be so kind, uh, I, I, it really does help the channel out. So if you are watching the VODs afterwards, please throw a comment down there, you know, go like on it. If you're liking it, if you're not liking it and you don't like it, that's fine too. I get it. Like I may not be for everybody and that's okay. Um, the, uh, but, you know, at least if you're going to dislike something, you should at least leave one comment and tell why. Just be like, eh, I don't like you. Except for there's some people that just do it just to do it. So, yeah, whatever. It's, it's the internet. Who knows? Um, but the buttons are down there. You guys are adults. Well, maybe. Maybe not. Maybe not an adult. Maybe you're a kid. That's fine, too. I'm all right with it. Um, but yeah, so do hit the hit the things that you think are needed to be hit, and then we'll go from there. Uh, and then uh, we'll just keep. I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. I, I'm I'm enjoying. I enjoy making stuff. I enjoy the community and hanging out with people. So I I I know it's a a matter of time for me on YouTube. Uh, like it. I, I, I've got enough determination that I will, I, I'm, I'm going to be around for a while. Uh, whether it takes me forever to get 100 views or if it takes me a week. Uh, like, hell, I could, you know, if it takes me a year to get 100 views, like, ah, oh, whatever. I've, I've already been here seven years, so whatever. But <laughs> we're going to do it. <laughs> Oh, 
Yeah, but nope, I'm just here to have fun and, and play some games and maybe help some indie devs out, maybe meet some cool people. Uh, and then, dude, this thing is a fucking, like, I am glad I didn't just go for, for a shotgun. Like, holy cow, that is a lot of flipping bullets. Take the walk. Got it. Well, the, the last machine gun is on eight. So we got two more points till basically all the machine guns are fire hoses. But it's just this point at stuff and it's just okay, I'm I'm done with that. That's like, you know, I, I don't I don't want that to live anymore. I've had I've had enough of it. Like, no, I want to go out this way. Oh, okay, fine. You want you want to have a chat? All right, well, let's have a chat then. And that the little bit of push, holy crap, so much damage. So that is level ten on all the sh all the machine guns. It's so much Jacka. Let's do more reloading. That that reload, it like literally split for like a half a second. Is it's not even it's not even that long. It's it's fast. Like the faster I can get that reload, so that it's not a not a deal. Because if not, what ends up happening is uh, exactly that. Where well, not that. It's oh Jesus. I need more damage. I need a lot more damage. These little bug things are, are kind of a pain in the butt. I don't like them. Uh, more damage. Yeah, those uh the little scaraby things, crab walker things or whatever they are, uh they're they're armored or something. They uh they can take the punches. I am not a fan. <clears throat> oh, I did not pause that, I meant to. Oh, that hurt. Oh, good. Since the little ones weren't bad enough, let's get the big ones in now. That, that'll that be helpful. At least with the overclock, that, that causes a little bit more damage. So, uh, no, no, I, I don't, I'm not, I'm not, no, 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 no. Ow. Uh, I think, I think we're going to take the armor. Yeah, these, these guys, these guys are starting to whittle me down. I just, it, well, granted, I'm hitting them like ridiculously fast, but I've got to hit them so many times. Stupid penguin.
Alright, come on, penguins. Penguins in these battle scarabs. I don't I don't like it. The problem is, is they're taking so much damage to kill, I'm not getting as many experience uh, orbs right now, uh, so my leveling slowed way down. It doesn't matter, I can't I can't evolve the laser anyway. Most I can do is get do more damage. And a faster you know, or faster fire would So these things that the bugs that just travel across the screen, they're actually decent to follow to because they'll shove the other bugs out of the way. Oh, good. Uh, so that was emergency shielding. So that's, uh, I'm going to go with helpful. They are, they are not liking my shenanigans today. Not liking my shenanigans at all. Like it better when you guys don't try to murder me. Since that's not gonna happen. I guess I'll just have to murder you first. So there that's the laser maxed out. And that is that is some some pews on target right there. Hoping I get out. It's not. It didn't work. Now I'm trapped in. Oh, good. I'm trapped in here with all these guys. That's gonna be well fun. Uh, yep. More damage. Dead. Oh, so it did, it did okay. It was, that's a good amount of damage. I'm, I'm really surprised uh, at how well it did. I think the problem with that one is, is I needed to do the damage multiplier uh, because I just I could put the damage out that I needed. Um, maybe, 
Maybe I do another one and we try to load the machine guns, two laser blasters, uh, and try to get the, the damage multiplier. And they're like the crit chance. All right, so let me go back here. Let me go to armory. So the damage multiplier is maxed out. Which one's this? That's the armor. So the crit chance, the fire rate, I don't, oh, yeah, the fire rate, I don't really need. Um, I need, I think I need the critical chance more. Yeah, so I think if I get the damage, I get critical chance and then uh, probably the gravity reactor. So let's uh, let's go in and see if we can actually do what we are trying to do now. Even though it may be more fun to do it with Benedict. But I'll try it with you recommend. All right, so we'll see. We'll see how well uh, my my craziness actually works. So I think I'm gonna take the Cosmic Guardian first. That the, the extra damage will help me. I, I think the, the the damage one. I think I have a. It's it's fairly common. I think. So we have both of our cosmic guardians. I probably try to pick up. Like if I see the laser drop, I'll pick up the laser quick. So all that stuff where we were with that. Laser. Uh, so AI core, critical chance. I think I'll pick up the this guy first, because having more pickup is is the earlier you get the pickup the better. At least I think. Uh, that's all garbage for now, anyway. Oh, more garbage. Uh, we will take increased damage. Yeah, so we're already doing it. Uh, reload, I'm not worried about. Take more damage. Honestly, the more damage I can have, the probably the better. Get as many points as we're putting out. Uh, it's probably probably for the best because we're gonna be putting out so many points that like getting that damage multiplier up higher or faster. Uh, it's gonna, it's, we'll do work. That's all. Um, I do not want that one. I'm just gonna skip it. Give it, get the reroll for later.
Take the Cosmic Guardian. The trick is just try to get my damage up high enough and my bullet speed fast enough that by the time uh, the, those uh, like the scarab thing go up, we're uh, we're we're doing okay. All right, so we got two Gatling guns, two lasers. We're uh, we're we're progressing. Two cosmic guardians. Basically, need uh, two more. Uh, I'll re-roll that. Got the guardian. It's fine. Fits the narrative I'm trying to write. Skip that one again. Definitely. Like this, it, it's just like, oh, that's what you want? Yep, that's not happening today, buddy. I swear, especially some of these, the roguelike rogue it's almost they have, uh, it's like they have logic in them that says, oh, they, they try to figure out what, what you're trying to do. And as soon as it figures it out, it's like, oh, well, I'm not going to give you that anymore. Critical chance by 5%. That should be our critical chance by 20. Uh, it doesn't seem like it though. So our critical chance, our, yeah, critical chance is 20%. I think it would, uh, you'd think we would see a lot more crit numbers. Because honestly, at 20%, you know, you should have, you know, a, a more like that. Like, basically, it, you should start seeing orange numbers a lot. Time. Try not to get the part where I want and then hit skip because I'm good at that. <laughs> damage or cosmic guardian. I think I'm going to go with damage. Even though my damage is almost maxed out. Like normally you'd be like, oh, well, you know. But the, the thing is, is once you kind of have the parts locked in, you can't get anything else. So as long as you can make the levels, you're eventually going to, to level everything up. So damage and a good amount of crit damage. And so, what are you doing back there, Cooper? Critical damage, yeah. Little pin cast with guardian. And then the other thing too, especially with the uh, the dreadnought stuff, the things you put on your back, uh, 
the more of the same one you get, the faster you're going to be able to over or uh, cause something to uh, max out and then be able to uh, evolve it. Still, I'm still missing. Still missing two guns. Stop it. Okay, everything else will be maxed out before I get my damn uh, machine guns. A shotgun it is just being difficult it is just does not want to give me more assault rifles or machine guns or whatsoever they are oh I'm hard I'm more hard-headed than you are game I will I will run completely out of rerolls and, and skips. <laughs> it's almost like it flat refuses now. Nope, oh, there it goes finally. Yep. Like you've already got two machine guns. Why do you want? Why do you want two more? For the memes. I want it for the science. Nope. 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 Being able to walk faster would probably be helpful right now. Nope. All right, we will keep going. Oh, we can put a lot of uh, lead into our target quickly. That's for sure. And it's the sad part is, is as soon as I can start leveling up the machine guns too, uh, they, they'll, they'll be even stronger. Oh, there they are. See, the game now who's hard headed? Haha, ha, I win. <laughs> So many points. Like, nope, I want the stuff in that direction to be gone. Oh, that reload is real. That, wait, that was at 12 already. Oh no, the gravity rack is at eight. The, my damage. Okay. That makes sense. That checks out. Pause real quick. I need a, I need a drink.
The old voice is getting scratchy. Basically just shooting through them now. Like, nope, I'm done. I just I want I want the stuff behind you to go away. Drag back here. We're gonna try to push the machine guns and the lasers up to ten. If I, if I get a machine gun or, or a laser, I'm going to push that up first. Well, I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll help the uh, the Guardian. If I can get because if I can get the Guardian to evolve, then yeah, so so with the damage and everything, that's that's doing a lot better. More critical damage. That should be fifty percent critical chance. My cursor right. Yeah, see, that feels more like 50% critical chance. All the murdering. Spray all the bullets. Ooh. Yeah, those things those things are taking a beat. I do not like that. Oh, that is that is good. Stay, stay out in front of them and kill the ones that are coming at me. Yeah, it's just, it, it's a good idea, but I just, I'm not doing enough damage. Like, there's not, like, with these armored guys, like, the, the bunch of little bitty hits isn't, isn't doing good because I think their armor just, or they got many hit points, and it's just not enough. That at least give me a chance to get a little bit more damage per hit. The more often I can crit, better off it is. It goes from 20 to like 36 or 60 or something. Probably need to put points into health. You know, if I make I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, so it's it's a good idea, but it just it's not strong enough. Uh, it just it needs more help. Um. So yeah, so four four machine guns, two laser blasters, and two cosmic darkness. Why not? I get, and it may have helped, like, if I hadn't had to put
push so far like it may have been good to put uh point like just to pick up the shotguns also or try uh, four points in the Tesla would be cool I do want to try I don't know if the orbital striker or the siege cannon would be worth it um Uh, I think I'm going to try the Siege Cannon first if we can. We'll see if we can put some points into a Siege Cannon build. So, uh, see, the Armory. So, what is the Siege Cannon? That is the red guy, right? It's a new game. So, he has three. The Lazarus has four. Maybe, maybe we'll go with we'll go with Benedict again. Uh, we're gonna go. We'll go with Benedict, and we'll get. Uh, maybe we'll try uh, like two machine gun, two laser if we can. If we can, maybe three siege guns. I don't know if we'll be able to get three siege guns out of it, but. It, it'll be funny to try. And then probably... Uh, uh, rate of fire may not be a bad thing to get for the seed cannon. Because I think it's going to fire fairly slowly. Definitely get a gravity reactor. a reactor for now adding more reactors for rate of fire probably isn't a bad thing rate of fire is your friend yeah the only bad part about uh This guy is not getting to fire where he wanted to. Um, damage. Damage is always good. I like damage. <laughs> or overclocks. Also, if you pick an overclock, it just it just resets the time where it doesn't add. That sucks. Uh, we're not doing either one of those. Loading belt probably be a good thing to have. The rate of fire and reload speed. Uh, we'll, we'll go with a laser blaster. That seems like a dumb idea. I like it. Machine gun. Sure. He said, I don't know if these builds are any good. Uh, I just think they're funny. It does not want to give me a C cannon. Look, game, I've, I've proven how hard-headed I can be. I will 
burn this mother down. Get more, more pews. Fire. I like it. Siege cannon. Siege cannon. Oh, it's guns too. So his reload time takes a little while. Uh, nope, we're not doing any of those. Uh, I finally do that. And do it. I'm going to do triple siege cannons. Damn it. Uh, re roll it. Uh, we will take the machine gun. Nope, I am doing, I am doing three seed cannons. Whether it's good or bad, I'm going for it. I'm all in. <laughs> Take that, that's fine. Or damage, okay with that. More machine guns. Like, I'll take other things that, like, if, if I need them. Um, or I'm, I'm using them. No sense in burning rerolls when I can, you know, use a machine gun. All right. Nope. Not not doing it. I got plenty of skips game. Might as well just give me what I want. I'm going to get it anyway. Fine. Put more laser pew then. Be interesting to see once we get the... Uh, get those in. Uh, if we can actually get one of them to evolve and see what happens. To, to start seeing like them as they, they level up. To see what, what kind of more damage. If it gets crazier or fires faster. Like the Crystal XT right now would be great. Fine. 
Aim a siege cannon. Uh, okay, fine. I'll, I'll take that. Siege cannon. Triple siege cannon. Finish him. Uh, damage. I like it. Alright, so now we got triple siege cannon. Now it's just trying to convince one of the siege cannons that wants to be maxed out. Uh, so it's trying to get enough, enough parts to do that. But the good news is, is it should only give me things I can use now. Uh... Go, go damage. And honestly, you know, the triple siege cannon may not be, you know, ready to fire. I like it. Sad part is the rate of fire probably isn't helping machine guns and lasers a lot. But it's helping. Reload. And you just see him boom <laughs> explode. So the the uh, siege cannon definitely helps with the uh, the damage. Get some more more reloads. More uh, more rate of fire. Because the faster I can get the siege cannons firing, the better off we are. Like, it would probably be best, like, whatever, like, the slowest, uh, weapon, uh, like, fire rate, uh, combined with a siege cannon would probably be good. Like, the, uh, well, no, the, the purple pulse cannon, you think, those are, that would be reload, I think, because it's a single fire. That would be reload speed. And then that's the trick of getting the, the synergy of trying to get like all stuff that the, the reload speed and the weapon speed both work for. They want a bunch of really slow firing weapons and, and put the reload speed and uh, the fire rate, both of those on. And that way you, you fire faster and you reload faster. And... That more damage. The trick is, is uh, once we get to the uh, the armored bugs, that's that's when it gets ugly. That's the that's the part where we're having trouble getting past is is because we just don't have the damage to be able to, to force our way through it. I don't think they changed any graphics with that up upgrade. Have a chat with the boss or the mini boss here. That knockback is nice though. Yeah, anytime I can put points into a siege cannon, I will put points into that center siege cannon uh, and try to see if I can get get it, get one of them evolved. 
if I can get if I can get a siege cannon evolved, we can see what it does. Like once once we we really start maxing the siege cannon out. So there's, there's our nemesis. Well, armor clogged. Okay, what well, we're doing, we're at least taking some of them out. Yeah, we're actually ripping through them fairly quickly. It's just they're coming from all sides, so it's hard to hard to stay stay on the, the ones we need to shoot without just charging and hoping they die before we get there. Oh yeah, yep. Let's let's get increased damage. Like all joking aside, like. It'd be a hard, a hard battle between uh, increasing the uh, the siege cannon and uh, the two x damage right now, because like this. Well, oh wow, we're we're doing some damage to those guys. We just gotta not get trapped like that. Okay, uh, so the siege cannons are doing some work. May may have been the way to get through here. Look at a crystal magnet. Couldn't give me the XT one though, could you? No, that'd have been too easy. That would have made my life okay. But no, you just got to give me whatever the one you. Oh, you jerk. <laughs> yeah. Okay, game. We know we know the stubborn one is. Oh, good, the penguins. Just just who I was looking for. Take that, you stupid penguins! Ouch. The trick is just to, to try to run away, but not get yourself trapped to a corner of the map, and where all your you're stuck between a wall and a, and a penguin. That that stuff will happen. Mark my words: it's one thing you don't want to be stuck between a wall and a penguin. <laughs> At least we're murdering people. Hoping at some point that one of them changes to a different graphic because most of them, like as you level them up, they change graphics. So, but usually about level ten is where they start changing graphics. So, 
get more more reload. Reload speeds. Kind of turn into a freaking machine gun. Like <laughs> these things are firing so fast. It's like machine gun <laughs> siege turrets. It's great. I didn't realize that there's there's uh like it's like a bear paw on top of the turtle. Like wolf and bear paws and stuff on top of them. We'll do we'll do two X damage again. I like it. Oh, I love Pretzel so much. There's some really good songs on Pretzel. We talked about it earlier in the stream, but if you guys do uh, need DMCA free music uh, that you can use on YouTube and Twitch, uh, there is a link down in the, uh, the description for Pretzel Rocks. Uh, go check them out. Uh, there's a lot of services out there that do the DMCA music free stuff now. Uh, pretzel, I, I've been using them for a couple of years, uh, and I've had a few a few false flag DMCA's. They've taken care of them really quickly. Uh, they cleared them up, and you know the process to kind of report them is is a little tedious. You have some hoops to kind of jump through, some screenshots you got to take, things like that. Uh, but most of it's so that you can send it to them, and then they know that. Uh, so that they can figure out why why it failed uh, or what what happened to cause the BMCA to be claimed so that they can go yell at whoever it is and tell them, hey, stop that. Uh, it is, uh, like I, I paid, 50, uh, it's like 14, almost $15 a month to get the, the music, uh, but it's all DMCA free. I listen to it, you know, 15 hours a week uh, just for streaming on Twitch, and then I use it for all of my YouTube videos, all that stuff. It's a, a really good service. I uh, highly recommend it. Uh, and there is a 20% off code down there also if you want to use that. So, but you, there is a free option. You can you can stream with it with free, uh, and not uh, not cost you anything. Uh, there are some requirements to do that. Uh, so, uh, if you're going to use pretzel and, uh, you want to use a free version of it, make sure you are following the requirements for the free version. Basically, all you have to do is have, uh, give their bot access to your Twitch account and then, uh, allow it to post a link to the artist. So that way it basically is advertising the artist. So if, if the artist, uh, if somebody likes the song they're playing, they can actually do that. They also have the ability, uh, I haven't ever used it, but you can use it to request songs through Pretzel uh, for uh, bits. Uh, so basically, if somebody comes in, they really like a song that's on Pretzel, they can request that song, uh, and they pay bits to do it. Uh, the uh, Most of the bits then go to the creator uh, or the streamer, uh, and then some of the bits goes to Pretzel uh, and goes the, uh, the creator of the of the, uh, the and it's actually most most of the money goes to the uh, the streamer, uh, but you can kind of adjust how much money you want to go where. I know when I did it, I was trying to, to give more money to the to the uh, to the music guy, and it wouldn't let me. So I figure if somebody's going to request their song, the money should go to them. Oh, there's the XT back then, finally. It's 
Siege Cannon. Alright, so that's level 12 Siege Cannon. So it still hasn't changed the graphic any. Uh, but that is the evolution for the Siege Cannon. So we are going to start heading that direction. Go ahead. Probably should, I probably should get some health. See if I can get a uh, an emergency emergency pack. That's uh, being difficult. there so stand in this circle for a second hopefully hopefully we can do that before they uh they try to murder us widow maker can It looks like it doesn't look like it changed any. It looks like it still shows, looks the same. Um, so now if I go here and look, so that's the Widowmaker cannon. So it does 460 plus 386. Just holy crap! This does 22 plus 18. Oh my lord! So that's doing 460. So it's doing over 900, almost a thousand. Yeah, almost uh, about it's over 900, like 950 ish uh it's pretty 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 crazy pretty angry that's uh that's that's gonna leave some marks and then of course the fact that we've got it set up to be basically a, a machine gun so basically at this point we're using the lasers and the machine guns to kind of just hold things off of us and just kind of push them back long enough for the siege cannon to just wreck them. This hit them for like 1200, 1300 damage for, for crits. All right, that thing's ridiculous. All right, I, I like the siege cannon. I don't know if having three of them up there is the best. Having, having. Like, I can't imagine having three maxed out ones. Be massive amounts of damage. Like, it may be better to have, like, a siege cannon and maybe a couple of, uh, like, Tesla turrets or something. So that way you have the siege cannon in the middle, and, or it doesn't matter where it is. It's wherever you put it up there. Um, it, it works the same no matter where it is. But then having, uh... Uh, a couple of Tesla turrets, so stuff as stuff is getting close to you, it can kind of keep it off you. And then the the siege turret can just wreck, especially the, the bigger bosses and stuff. The stuff that needs wrecking. Yeah, so it's 853, it looks like, for, for that, and then 12, 1280 ish for, for a crit. Uh, it is, that is a lot of flipping damage. Uh, we'll, we'll put some more into the... I guess I should have looked at C. How much damage. Let's do this. So the stage cannon right now is 28 plus 23.5 and it'll go to 32. This one's 22. So they go up a little bit. It's just that last. Oh, yeah. Sucks to be you, buddy. Hope you brought some friends and packed a lunch, because you're going to need it. 
<laughs> yep. Got my music. I got my shotty gun. Oh, oh. Okay, look, dude. I was kidding. I was. You didn't need to be so rude about it. I was. I was joking. I am sorry. I don't know. I don't know why you're so angry. Ah, I'm kidding. I know why you're angry. Gee, he did pack a lunch and bring some friends. Uh, so 32 to 34, so that's not a huge jump. That guy's got some hit points. I'm glad I went siege cannons because I don't think I, there's no way I could. Like, the amount of damage he's soaking up, especially from that siege cannon. Like, I, I don't think there's a way I could have, with just machine guns, I would have literally been running from it for two years. I'm already going to be running from it for two years. Ouch. Aha, suck a fish. Oh no, he brought... There, there's another one. Jesus. Did I just kill one of you? Oh, there's two of you now? That doesn't seem fair. There's only one of me. I, the jerk move. I know I told the last one to bring friends, but I was kidding. It was a joke. Oh, he went down quick. You guys are easy. Easy like Sunday morning. Ow! ow. Stop. I need to put some points into health. I, I need I need some emergency kits. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to take that. I, I would love to get more siege weaponry, uh, but um, I'm hurting. My my, my egg shell is cracked. It's not, it's not doing good. Oh, no, good. More big penguins now. Oh, Jesus. Emergency shielding. Woo! These dudes are angry. How many of you guys are there? Holy crap. Glad the later ones are easier. Jesus. All right, well, at least we got the second one of those open. Problem is, is I don't I don't know if I can I'm not gonna be able to stay still long enough to to uh, evolve that thing. Um, I would I would love to be able to set still long enough to evolve it, but I don't think that's possible. Not with these freaking yahoos chasing me. No. Ow. I 
begin with you guys. Uh, well, we're, we'll go for the evolution. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to sit still long enough to do it, but... Try to pump as much damage as I can into this thing. Oh, dead. Jeez. They they did not like me. <laughs> oh, what a mess. What a mess. <laughs> Yeah, so we got to see. We were almost, we almost uh, evolved the other one too. That was the best. Did we open the other map at least? We we didn't even open the other map. Location not discovered. What do I got to murder to get the the other map? Holy crap! Man, I have six days. That's not a lot of monsters. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how much further I need to go into that freaking mission. Like, um, actually, guys, I think I'm gonna go ahead and shut down the stream for the night. I do want to thank everybody that, that did come in and hang out, and you guys are really awesome. Uh, please uh, come back, you know, hit hit the like if you if you do like the the stuff. Uh, let me throw a comment if you guys are watching the bot afterwards. Um, I think what I may do is take the bot and chop it up a little bit and uh, try to make a bunch of different videos out of it. So, with that being said, you guys be safe, and we'll talk to you soon.